Canada is the greatest country in the world. When my parents first moved here, when I was five years old, I saw them leave everything behind because they knew this country offered freedom, opportunity, and prosperity. I want to make sure that the next generation has the same opportunities that I had growing up in this great country. I knew that I couldn't stand on the sidelines and watch our country be torn apart by division, erosion of our charter, and skyrocketing debt. I fought for medical privacy and also for the rights of the unvaccinated when it was taboo to even consider that those who exercise medical choices shouldn't be punished and segregated from society. I'm not a career politician. I've had a successful career outside of politics. I will make principled decisions. We need to be courageous in fighting for the preservation of our country, standing up for Canada's sovereignty, lowering taxes and balancing budgets, developing our natural resources while protecting the environment, defending fundamental rights and freedoms, and defending our democracy, and standing up for parental rights, and offering real solutions to reconciliation. As the only candidate with an education in environmental studies and international law, I am best positioned to defend our nation's sovereignty against the real threat of global organizations that want to infringe on our sovereignty. I will always be the voice that is dedicated to you, the Canadian people, and I will never put my career advancement above defending your rights. I pledge to continue to be that bridge builder and fight to make Canada the freest and most prosperous nation in the world.